What is going on guys? My name is Jeff Bosnomi is Top Ramen FTW. That's my PS3 username and Oh my gosh. <laughs> Matt Kane just threw a perfect game for the San Francisco Giants. <clears throat> I'm just speechless right now. I, it just happened an hour ago. I listened to the last uh, I listened to everything from five innings on and uh, boy it's amazing. I was I was ecstatic, overjoyed. I still am. I watched the videos, <laughs> all the videos they have on that game online right now, and uh, it's amazing. It's it's fantastic. For those of you who aren't familiar with baseball, a perfect game is something that's thrown by a pitcher, and he has to throw a complete game, all nine innings. And retire all 27 batters without allowing a hit or a walk, a base runner of any type. So no errors. You know the team can't commit any errors uh, to let base runners get on base. No base runners for the entire game for the opposing team. And uh, he did it. He struck out 14 batters. And you know, to be honest, I, I thought about it. About the uh, let's see. The fifth inning, yeah, he was pitching in the fifth, so he had pitched four complete innings. I started listening uh, because I saw the line score was zero hits, zero, you know, zero walks, zero runs, zero errors, and I thought, wow, he's pitching perfect so far. That that's great. That'd be cool if he could pitch a perfect game. But then I thought to myself, ah, it's, that's, you know, that's not gonna happen. I lit literally told myself, no, it's not gonna happen. I mean, I'm a Giants fan, but let's be honest, this is only the twenty second time in Major League Baseball history <laughs> that a perfect game has ever been thrown. I'm not even sure how many games that is um, that have been played. I mean, hundreds of thousands of baseball games have been played, and it's only happened 22 times. So maybe millions of baseball games have been played <laughs> for, for, for at the professional level. So it, it's amazing. And I cannot be happier for the Giants, you know, the fans, the team, the franchise. You know, it's amazing. I, it's unbelievable. I can't, I can't even put into words how great it is. Anyway, um, <laughs> yeah, so I'm bringing you guys a little MLB 11, the show action here. And, uh, wow, <laughs> what, a, what a day. It's fantastic. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I thought I'd bring you guys some highlights because it would be perfect, you know, show a little baseball. Uh, to go along with the uh, the perfect game, <laughs> and um, well, that's something that's gonna live on. I mean, the Giants won the World Series in 2010, and now the perfect game, and that along with the you know the Barry Bonds home runs, that is uh, the last decade. You know, th those are the stories for Giants fans. That's what uh, the fans are gonna remember. So, real special time for all the fans. But uh, anyway. Yeah, so I just uh, did a little uh, video earlier for Call of Duty and thought I'd mix it up a little bit, bring you guys something different. I don't want it to be all Call of Duty based, all my videos. So, uh, yeah, I'm bringing some MLB 11 to show. I'll do some Black Ops later on. Maybe some Gotham City Imposters. Still got to do a Battlefield video. A Battlefield is tough, though. I mean, I love Battlefield, don't get me wrong, but it's tough because there's no vault. You know, you can't, uh, you got to record live, basically. <laughs> or just <clears throat> record it as you play and then, you know, do a little commentary over but I kind of want to do a live commentary for Battlefield I think that'd be fun but uh anyway yeah I <laughs> hit a lot of home runs in these games against the Brewers I just crush the Brewers every time I play them I don't know what the deal is I mean the first inning there already five home or five runs there's six runs huff homers <laughs> it's ridiculous it's way too many you know it's obviously a video game I think I hit back to back to back home runs in the first inning and uh the commentators in this game they <laughs> They say, this is almost like a video game. It's ridiculous. It kind of is a joke, you know. But look at it. Second inning, nine runs already. That's crazy. That's not even, you know, you n almost never see that in a baseball game. <laughs> but, uh, you know, other than the, um, there's ten runs. Wow. Other than the perfect game, the Giants actually came, had a great game tonight. Brandon Belt hit a two-run homer. Melky Cabrera hit a two-run homer. Gregor Blanco hit a two-run homer. And uh, Giants are swinging the bats. And Posey doubled, you know. Uh, Sandoval had a RBI hit. So, you know, it's, it's really good to see the Giants uh, start swinging the bats a little better because they really need it, you know, for quite a few years now. Ever since Bonds left, basically, 
the story's been the same. Great pitching, but not enough runs produced, you know, to back that pitching up. So it's uh, it's really nice to see them, you know, hitting the ball real well. And uh, look at that. Sit down, Ryan Braun. <laughs> um, Granderson's club and a homer there, too. Yeah, I just, I right now, I'm just I'm speechless. I don't know what to say. Um, I was shouting. I'm sure my neighbors got pissed off, but I was shouting and, I was like literally, you know, almost about to break down in tears because it's, it's just something that uh, I'm probably not going to see that happen again in my lifetime to a Giants, uh, a Giants pitcher. You never know; it might happen, but it, that's a long shot. You know, they've been playing baseball 130 years, and um, I did the math. If if 130 years, if they played 162 games each year, this is not counting the postseason um, at all. That's 21,060 games that have been pitched and played and that is the very first perfect game by a San Francisco Giant pitcher so and it's crazy because Kane's having a great year he already threw a one hitter against the Pirates earlier this year so and the only hit he allowed with which is funny uh, was to the opposing pitcher the opposing pitcher got a single I think it was an infield single or some crazy thing but uh, he one hit the Pirates and then two hit the Phillies so he's having a fantastic year. I mean, they, they just, it's a good thing, you know, Brian Sabian locked him up with a, a good long contract because this guy is legit. <laughs> he's what you call in the gaming world legit. <laughs> but, um, yeah, the, the last pitch of the game I saw, I was watching the replay. He threw a 94 mile an hour fastball, 125 pitches. That's, that guy's arms just got to be like on fire right now. <laughs> you know, he probably. Probably all the adrenaline was, you know, was not getting to him because he, he probably wasn't feeling it then. But he's going to be feeling it later. That's a lot of pitches for a pitcher to throw. I mean, they normally try to keep a pitcher 100, you know, 90, 100, 110 pitches at the most. You know, this guy threw 125, and he's throwing 94-mile-an-hour fastballs. Are you kidding me? That's ridiculous. So, yeah, good night for uh, good night for baseball altogether. You know, the Mariners threw a no-hitter last week using combining four pitchers. And uh, uh, June 1st, Johan Santana for the Mets, he threw a no-hitter. So, And Philip Umber threw a perfect game this season, too. So this is only the second time in baseball history two perfect games were thrown in the same season. So uh, it's, uh, you know, I think pitching is the new thing. You know, the era of steroids is over for uh, hitters, you know, clubbing 900-foot home runs. <laughs> I'm exaggerating a bit, but... Now it's the uh, it's a pitcher's era, so uh, yeah, I'm pretty excited about it. Anyway, if you don't like baseball, this commentary probably wasn't for you. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it says it in the title, Matt Cain. Um, I'll, I'll title it something like that, Matt Cain. You know, perfect game, MLB 11, the show, talk highlights, something like that. So, but if you don't like baseball, this one wasn't for you. But if you're a baseball fan, especially a Giants fan, this is a great night for you. <laughs> anyway, guys. Top Ramen FTW. Talk to you later. Have a good one.